Hi everybody. Well, this is Jason speaking, and today we're gonna go over part three: how to make money online with the stock market. Part three. And so let's follow up, guys, on um, Shopify stocks. All right. Here is the chart, the price chart of Shopify. All right, and here um, you can, as you can see, um, we are in front of an ascending triangle pattern, which broke out and then which completed it touched the target and um, here you have the base of the triangle is 26 to 32 all right so basically how to calculate the target is you take that difference that price difference all right um, 32 minus 26 is six dollars now you multiply it by 80 percent 0.8 so you add that to the breakout all right which is 32 and it gives you an approximation of your target where you should start um, selling your your stocks or thinking about the an exit strategy all right so um, so this shows you guys how important um, um, patterns are all right so that was a ascending triangle pattern all right with this just with this I was able to take a decision and um, take a trade on that stock all right so I didn't have any insiders information I didn't have any I didn't read about Shopify I don't know what kind of products they are releasing I don't know what are um, the chairman or CEO's decision about the stock all right and just for you to know to see that I'm not lying that this is not um, something set up you can even do your research on Shopify yourself from your own computer and you will still find the same values, all right? This is Shopify right now, all right, at $36.79, just like I have it on my graph. $36.79, all right? So this is not something um, that I made up, all right? This is the facts. This is actual prices of Shopify today in August 2016, all right? And look at that volume, that spike in volume on that trading day now look at the weekly chart all right so each bar represents a week look how neat this is ascending triangle with the breakout and boom all right so the same thing here with think or swim a nice neat ascending triangle and then boom after the breakout volume the price start jumping so let's see okay now um ascending triangle complete we spoke about this now let's take a look at um ford stocks in 2009 this is guys this is when um i was studying chart patterns all right uh, like 2008 2009 and this is what i saw with ford and i got sold on chart patterns that when i realized that in the one chart in only one company, I saw like a combo of patterns, one after the other, and it was amazing. So check it out, guys. I'm gonna show. I'm gonna show it to you. So as you can see, the date 2009-2010. So this is Ford between and during that period of time. This is a falling wedge pattern. You can Google it. Right? It means a reversal. All right. So we had the breakout and then the price increased. And then what it did, it did a ascending triangle, which you're already familiar with that now. All right. And then we have a breakout. Ascending triangle are known to be continuous continuation patterns. So it went up. All right. And then what it did, it did what we called a cup and endo pattern. So you can Google all those patterns. Um, on your own computer all right and this is also known as a continuation pattern meaning that it's gonna continue its movement upward and then it designed a symmetrical triangle which also is a continuation pattern so breakout and then what it did it did a double top pattern which is a, a reversal pattern so it's uh, subjective that the price will fall which it did all right it broke it broke uh, the neckline and then it shift downwards all right so again let me repeat that for you falling wedge so you can google it falling wedge 
symmetrical triangle cup and endo pattern symmetrical triangle and double top pattern all right so uh, <laughs> again never read about the company never doesn't know what are their uh, internal decision internal strategy so guys this is closing all right thank you for watching like comment share this video with your friends family and loved ones all right and what else don't forget to subscribe to this channel so you can see all my videos all right and guys see you until next time and remember you can follow me on facebook twitter all right uh, message me add me uh, like my posts and guys thank you very much for the views